Your life is boring as fuck and you know it. That's why you clicked on this video. Every day of your life feels the same because it is. Even if you're doing healthy habits like meditation, going to the gym, eating healthy, your life is still, is still boring. You're still just doing the same shit every day because then you're never gonna make any new memories. You're not really living in the present moment because you're just living in a routine. You're not being spontaneous, you're not trying new things, you're not taking any risks, and that's why your life is boring. My my life used to be the exact same, I would just do the same shit every day. And that's going to be boring, it's just going to lead you to being sad, and that's what we're going to change in this video. Alright, obviously it's not going to feel any different if you're just doing like, let's say Monday, you know, you go to the gym, you eat some food, you know, maybe play some games. Tuesday you do the same thing, Wednesday you do the same. Of course every day is going to feel the same and be boring as hell, like, what do you think? So how do you change this, you know? If you're doing the same shit every day, how do you switch from a life that's boring to a life that's fun with many risks, many memories, but still being healthy and maybe have a routine if you want to? It's pretty simple. You just have to do more things. Basically, I don't know, just do things like with your friends if you can. But if you can't, then just doing things by yourself is fine too. Something I like to do with my friends, don't do this by yourself. Uh, always have at least one person with you is exploring abandoned buildings. I'll put some pictures on the screen right now of some amazing abandoned buildings I've explored. Just be careful because there might be like homeless people trying to kill you and stuff. Always bring a knife, always bring another person. But otherwise you'll be you'll make some very good memories and take some very good pictures. Other cool things are hikes, you know, going to the pool, just going on walks, maybe playing some video games with your friends or even just by yourself. Just don't do it all day, every day. But switch it up, you know, switch switch up what you do every day and that'll make it more interesting. If there's something you've always wanted to do, like a business idea you've always had, like, I don't know, maybe you want to try some of those telegram methods, go ahead. Like, why not? You're young. This is what life is for. You're supposed to take big risks when you're young. With risk, there's almost always reward. Unless the risk is like jumping into a volcano. That's just kind of stupid. Don't do that. But like, if let's say you'd like to start like a business, and there's a little bit of risk because there's like an investment cost at the start. Go ahead and do it. Like, what's the big deal if you lose it? You're you're like, how, how old are you, bro? You're like, you're less than 18 years old, probably. Who cares? Just try whatever you want to do. Just do whatever you want, basically. By that, I don't mean lie in your bed and watch TikTok all day. I mean to do like active things you've always wanted to do. Like, obviously, I've always wanted to go skydiving. I can't really do that. But I can still do other fun stuff, too, that isn't sitting in my bed and watching reels all day. So basically, you just need to stop being afraid of change and start taking risks, start doing things, start having fun, and every day will stop feeling the same and feel different with new surprises, and your life is going to be really enjoyable. Always remember that when you're in the present moment and making memories, that's when you're at your happiest. When you're watching TikToks in your bed, you're not in the present moment and you're not making any memories. Remember that. If you enjoyed this video and you would like more philosophy and mental health videos in the future, then please be sure to leave a like, subscribe, and Comment down below and turn on notifications. Thanks and I'll see you in the next one.